So I've been having some fun with AI lately and I asked it to create a video for me for a commercial or something just to kind of promote baton twirling. And I have to show you the results. They were uh, nothing short of hilarious. Imagine twirling a baton high into the sky, then catching it with grace and precision. And it's like Welcome nothing to, to do with baton twirling, twirling, but it's this funny. Not just about and like, why are these stick. kids outside? It's about <laughs> discipline, focus, and rhythm. It's about a little part closer, of the but still not there. Fun. From a distance, it may look easy, but it takes practice. And I'm pretty sure she's not real at all. Art. Like none of these kids are real. Worry. The journey from fumbling beginner to confident twirler yep. is They all look like AI if you like look really closely. Twirling is not just a sport. It's a This is more rhythmic gymnastics if uh, if anything, so I think they're a little confused. Spectacle that is as captivating to watch as it is to perform. So, if you're looking for a new challenge, why not give baton twirling a twirl? It's a great way to make new friends, learn new skills, and have a whole lot of fun. Embrace the rhythm, join the team. Yeah, like, no one's ready for baton, baton class twirling. either, so. It's not perfect, but that's the worst it will ever be. I laugh about it now, but just realize that, like, this is, I mean, this is the future. This is how people are going to start making commercials, and we're going to, I think we're going to start seeing a huge difference between, like, what's real, what's not. If you haven't yet, make sure you're following me for more tips on baton twirling and maybe some more AI stuff too.